sometimes God don't show up on time because it ain't enough people present. Your breakthrough just ain't for you. I need your mama them, your cousin them, your haters, and your exes to see what I do for you in this season. Am I preaching to anybody in here? This portion of the video is sponsored by Love Me Hair. If you want something quick, simple, and just straight to the point, then this is for you. They sent me a bob. It's a 10 inch bob. It is, I think, a two by six closure. So there's no lace to cut. There is nothing to melt. It's a glueless wig, a grab and go, which we are here for. It's a blood cut. We love that. And it, it, this color, this wig, sorry, because it's not, it's not colored. This wig is a natural color and it's blunt and straight. I love that. I love something that's easy. It's literally going to be a one second install. This is the box that it comes in. Let's jump into it. I love me a good old easy wig, y'all. I'm not here to do all the extra stuff. Like if I have to do extra stuff, I'm not interested. So let's get into it. Bobs are so good for the summertime and just all around. Like Bob, Bobs give a very classy, very, you know, I keep saying that TikTok. A very classy, very demure, <laughs> and elegant. Look at her. Boom. Ready to go. Ready to go. Yes. Straight out of the box. She's bobbing. She is bobbing. Do you see the closure? She is a two by six. Six inches long, two inches across, so you have a nice parting. I did get a few free gifts. The bag to store your wig, a wig cap, and just some free gifts that you would use. But let's get straight into putting this wig on. One second, and we're done. Okay guys, this is the wig straight out of the packaging. Of course, we're gonna have to straighten her, but it's the blunt cut for me. <laughs> She's giving, okay? She's giving already. I'm gonna get my hot comb and get us together. Guys, the bob, she's bobbing. I am feeling her. What? Okay, hold on. <laughs> My flat iron is on, but Go back. It's not stiff. It's moving. Is she bouncy? I love the blunt cut. I did add a little bit of my waxing stick on there. But do you see that? Look at the movement. Come on. Yes. <laughs> and then the greatest part is this is completely glueless. I didn't cut anything, by the way. It comes just like this. And on the sides, your hair is tucked away. You have nothing like left out no leave outs or nothing and you get this really nice blunt cut bob look this is now my new everyday girl if you watch me you know i love me a bob and i've been wearing this blonde bob that i got from love me previously like every single day now this will be the everyday girl i love the length it's perfect it's cut well it has movement i don't have to leave any of my hair out and i did um I did push it back just a little bit just so it comes do you see how it looks like it's coming out of my scalp like literally it does not give closure it does not give wig it looks really good I am seeing my wig cap just a little bit but I'm gonna add a little bit of my foundation there outside of that everything is like a 10 out of 10 
I love this. I love the fact that my hair isn't out and I can just grab this and go. Every single day we are going to be cute. This is very classy. A bob will get you right every single time. I'm sorry guys, I have, I have a little bit of hair on me because I was styling the hair. But this is she. Let me know what y'all think. Huge shout outs to Love Me for sponsoring us. And I'm gonna be talking like this. So, <laughs> sorry. The hair is moving. She isn't stiff. She is moving. What? Okay. If you guys like this hair or if you're interested, definitely click the description box. The links will be there. Huge shout outs to Love Me for sponsoring us. Hey, let's jump into the vlog. Yeah, here. <laughs> we are in Walmart buying toiletries for my son. Oh my god, I didn't know there was this many options. I can't decide. So I was getting like a lot of everything, <laughs> different options. can see if y'all are seeing me but okay I was trying to talk to y'all through the mirror and be cool but it, it's not working good morning good morning good morning I am I don't think my camera is straight hold on oh it's not it's not perfectly straight but it hold on That's not bad. Good morning, guys. I am going to the gym. And I know it's my gym wig. I had it in a ponytail, so I don't know why I'm acting like it's cute and laid, but I, <laughs> I just put it on. I'm going to put it, of course, pull back. We're going to the gym. I started in this bathroom last night. My son's not this, my son's bathroom because it's the second bathroom, which would be um the bathroom for the guests i guess the other bedrooms upstairs the other three bedrooms but i mean it's his bathroom period so i started doing it i uh, the towels guys so i washed the towels the towels from target the casaluna ones these washed beautifully 
the waffled one. There's another one over there. The full towel, it washed so well. You see the other set of towels that I got? If you watched my previous vlog, you would have seen. I got some towels from, whatchamacallit? I got it from Home Goods, Bro, the dryer, um, the part that collects the dust from your clothes when you wash it, that, when I took it out, it was like a big thing of gray fiber. Those towels shed so bad and they don't look the same. The Castelluno ones, they look beautiful, just the same. It still looks like how I got it. But the other one, it, it don't look right. And guess what? I already washed them. Let me go get them so I can show it to you. I already washed them, so we're going to keep them. I think I'm going to purchase another one of the Castelluno waffle ones because I like how I like how they look. They look more luxurious. I don't know how the drying power is, you know, when you dry off, but if I think it'll, it'll work. I bought the white ones for myself, for my bathroom, but I didn't wash mine as yet. I was focusing on getting my son um, together. Wait. Guys, these are the, these are the ones from Home Goods. Oh, these smell good. These smell like I'm a good housewife. This smells like I'm a good mom. They smell so fresh, baby. And they soft. But I don't know why initially after I washed them, it was so much lint in the dryer. Like a big ball of it. When I took it out, I'm like, whoa, what is going on? So I don't know if it's the first wash, why it did that. Maybe when it washes again, it won't do that. But it was so much lint. And it was all gray. But they smell good. I wish y'all could smell it. it and they're soft. I'm going to keep them, of course. I mean, we washed it. How are we going to bring them back? But I love the look of the Casaluna one. So I'm going to let him use the Casaluna ones first. And I'm thinking I can put a hook behind the door because the door closes. And if he, you know, doesn't like the Casaluna ones, I could add this in the back because uh, these are not my fave. I love the look of the waffled ones. Those are cute. I can just add these on the hook in case he wants to have like a separate towel to like dry off or whatever. I'm gonna get a hook. That's a good idea. And this can be in the back because nobody's gonna see it. But y'all, exciting things. It's gonna be an amazing week. It already is. It's the best week of my life, baby. I got the most amazing news yesterday. <laughs> I've been crying too. Yeah, I cry a lot. It's okay. I've been crying this morning, but not crying out of sadness, but out of gratitude. I'm just overwhelmed with joy and just gratitude to the Lord. I was on my knees crying and thanking God this morning. Thanking God for answered prayers. It don't matter how long it takes. If he said he's going to do it, he's going to do it. Okay. Yeah, this is the best week of our lives. The best week ever. Ever, ever, ever. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm so excited. I'm going to go get ready, well, to go to the gym. And guys, I don't know what's been going on. I'm off topic with my armpit. Like, look at how it's been breaking out. If y'all know anything that I can use, I think online I read like baking soda or something. And usually when you shave, that's when your underarm gets dark and whatnot but I don't shave because shaving doesn't work for me so I wax my underarms I don't know why it's doing this I keep getting a lot of ingrowns this one is a little bit better she she ain't bad and then when I get the ingrowns it breaks out and then once I like pop them or well I try not to pop them once I like take the ingrown out it just gets bad like look at this and it leaves the spots and the spots look like they're not going away what can i do i was thinking maybe i can buy the topical what is that the fatal topical cream and like put it maybe that'll help if y'all know something let me know anybody yeah leave it in the comments because i don't know and it's so annoying and that's not gonna stop me baby i'm gonna always be in my little tops my sports bras and stuff and i'm gonna work out proud and i'm gonna wear my sleeveless i don't care i cannot help that <laughs> my underarms get the little ingrowns and that it's dark right now well right now who cares i'm still gonna wear my clothes anyways i, I did not meet my body we're gonna go i was showing you guys this last night 
but my memory card got full and I got tired. Look at these. Aren't these the cutest? So these are to put Q-tips and um, what else? Floss and I guess cotton or whatever other, other um, thing that you want because I had a thing to put like cotton Q-tips on the countertop and I'm like, no, 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 no. I don't want it to take up the entire counter and I went online and I saw these and these are just so nice, so nice, so cute. And you stick them on the wall and I got a set of four. So we're gonna figure out where we're gonna put them. I was thinking of putting them like here. And what I like is because it's clear-ish and it's white, it's not bulky. So boom, you're brushing your teeth. Take your floss out. Boom, you wanna clean your ears. You take your Q-tips out. I think it's perfect. So I got a set of four and they come with a sticky thing to put them on the wall. We're gonna deal with that later. I might just put two in my son's bathroom and put two in mine. I don't even know if I need them in mine. I literally bought them for him. But the only thing I think he's going to need are Q-tips and uh, floss, for sure, floss. And maybe I put a third one for like cotton balls, uh, just in case, I don't know. So there's that. And I have some acrylic shelves that I got that I want to put here on the wall. I was thinking, I don't know if it's a good idea, but who cares? We're going to do it and we're going to see. I'm gonna, I was thinking of putting it here. So he, he could have like his fragrances and whatnot. I think that would be cool. That means I'm gonna need to be buying him fragrances to build up, you know, a little, a little shelf. And I could probably put another, I could put both to be honest. So it would be like a little, a little vibe. We have to get a picture frame because this is blank. So we're going to the gym and then I'm gonna go to at home. I'd be talking smack about them, but sometimes they got some good things. I'm not gonna go to at home. Y'all can sponsor me if y'all want to. That'd be cool. I'd be over there. But they'd be upsetting me sometimes, but sometimes I'd be finding really nice things, as you can see with my son's room. So I wanna get a frame. I need to measure it like a a little something so the wall isn't so bare. And then I would put the acrylic shelves. I think that'll look good, guys. And I need a shower liner because the one I was using last night, it was from the other house because I bought it for his bathroom from the other house and it was never used. So I folded it and brought it here. It looks real bad. It doesn't go with this one. So I have to buy something else that looks better. It did not look good. It wasn't a go. We are in at home, y'all. Fresh out of the gym. Um, looking for stuff for the bathroom like artwork and little stuff why oh, i found this so how about i show it to you i'm thinking the opposite wall i can add this because the wood tones go loose back with the room like that little corner that i was making for my son's desk i could add it on the opposite wall that's blank i feel like that would go really well just skimming through looking at what they have they have some new stuff, so I'm trying to find something. Look at this, all this color. <laughs> wow, this is really colorful, but we're looking for stuff for his bathroom. And if I see any other interesting artwork, wow, they're so colorful in here. Yeah, these colors are coloring. <laughs> this is actually nice. I, this feels romantic. Why oh, I like this. Every time I like something like this, my friend looks at me weird, but I kind of like this frame. Where would I put it though? I feel like it gives the fall vibes. I wonder if I can put it downstairs. And that's $59. It's expensive. Like these vibes is currently a thing. Like these wine colors, these vibes. I love this. I feel like I would add it downstairs to add some color to the space, maybe in the entryway. But I feel like it might be too big. Oh well, let's go focus on the bathroom. That's what I came here for, the bathroom, the bathroom, the bathroom. I'm 
go get my cart. This is the artwork that's in my son's room. They still have it. Okay, she all was, you know, she all wanted it. That's the one. Alright guys, it's so much later. I just got in the car. I just came out of Target. I got some stuff, like some clothes for my son, uh, like basketball shorts and you know the active wear, the All in Motion brand. I have a lot of All in Motion active wear stuff. So I got quite a few of those for my son. I don't even know, like the sizes is in between because he's 13, but for the all emotion brand they only have like a large which is a 10 to 12 year old and then they have an extra large which is a 14 year old there's no in between size and then he's not the thickest he <laughs> seems a little skinny so i bought some in the 10 to 12 and i bought some in the size 14. i'm gonna see these are just like house clothes so as soon as he gets hair he has some clothes to put on and then we're gonna go shopping for clothes for school um i wanted to go to zara i've, I've been trying to go to zara since last week since last vlog yeah because this is a new vlog what yo i've been trying to go and i still haven't gone so i'm just like maybe i should just wait until he's here and then we just go to zara to get some stuff to get some gear to start school and then i'll just buy clothes as we go along i really wanted to get all the clothes in advance and have like a whole wardrobe but things happen and everything kind of happened to celebrate it so i'm just getting ready as quickly as possible for the most part and then i'll just get this stuff over time when he's at school i can always go to the mall by myself you know how i'd be at the stores but it's like it's five o'clock oh my god it's after five i'm going home i'm going home guys I bought a new rug for the front door because the one that's out there is making my, my nerves irk. So we're going to put that out. And I also bought like a brown runner looking thing. And I'm going to try and get like a wreath to add to the door. So it's really like fall fall. But I, I, I'm going to change the mat. The mat outside is not cute. It's upsetting me. Y'all. I have a few things to show y'all. And I'm going to put the fall things like the little fall touches in the house and be done look at this foolishness this is what happens at home no bags look at all my stuff on the floor rubbish rubbish I'm so excited to finish this bathroom well not this my son's bathroom i just brought paxton outside he's waiting for me oh my god you still have your leash on hold on Guys, I bought a new rug. Oh, I set it in the car, right? I was gonna get the one with the fall stuff, but this kind of has like a leave. I'm gonna show it to you. And then I got a scatter rug from at home. I don't know if they go together. We're gonna see. Hold on, let me get the rest of the stuff. Paxton, I'm coming. I'm gonna get you in a second. Hold on. you go to the store and they don't have any shopping bags and i have more stuff in the car oh see the scatter rug you know how we don't like the little brown colors and my scatter rug right now is black and white so i wanted to switch it out i think it'll look good with this um yeah it's all right it ain't like popping off the wall or nothing but it's okay i think with the, getting a wreath it will look better i like the scatter rug though the other rug that I was get, gonna get from Target says fall. I think it said fall. It had a whole bunch of stuff on there, but I didn't want it to be too crazy. Oh, it works. It's cute. Hold on. Y'all can't even see nothing. It's just dark. The door is open. The car is open. Like, there's a lot going on right now. Paxton is waiting. But see? Paxton, hold on. Let me take this off you because you've just been right there waiting this whole time. Ugh. 
and I took the mop out because I want to get some hot water in my bucket to mop the floor. I haven't mopped with, with water with hot water in a while. It's just been the Swiffer, and I don't like how the ground feels. But I like the, the colors because you know we're trying to get that brown vibe in. I never do too much, you know this. So the fall, Pax it, are you serious? <laughs> so the fall rug that I was gonna get, it had like leaves and some colors, it was different. And then before I got out of the store, I'm like, no ma'am, no ma'am. So we put it back. This will look nice. I just need to get a wreath. The wreath that we saw the other day at Target, I should have gotten it. It should, will it be in this vlog or it was in the previous vlog? I don't know. But it was very light, very elegant, you know, I don't like the, the extra stuff. It was a little fall, but not crazy. And I think it would look good with that. And you get the vibe coming inside, but they didn't have it at this Target. So I'm gonna check online to see if it's in stock at the other Target that I went to the other day. And I got this poster frame. I'm going to print a, vi a video while wow. I'm gonna buy a digital art from Etsy of a BMW because my son loves BMW. So he wants a video, not a video, wow. He wants a poster, oh my God. Blame it on me being hungry. I just took this steak out to get to room temperature. We're gonna make some steak and potatoes. I need to eat, because I haven't been eating properly, so we need to make some steak to get some protein. Um, but yeah, he wants a BMW poster, y'all. I'm trying to multitask. He wants a BMW poster and my bag, wait. This is garbage. Like, if they had just given me the stuff in a bag, we wouldn't have to come into the car this... Oh, shoot. This many times to pack all the stuff up. This is this is wrong. This is so wrong. At home. <laughs> what else is in this car? Oh, my bag. But I'll just leave this because it has all my cards and stuff. i just leave it under the seat so I can access once I get in the car. So shoot okay oh my gosh wait so oh wow somebody's oh my cousin is calling me my cute cute cousin hold on hello Oh my gosh, guys, I am tired. I came home. But look, why do my eyes look like this? Oh my god. I came home. I was talking to my cousin. I was talking to my son. I've been doing a lot. And I'm just like tired. I opened the Amazon package. I saw this um, oil diffuser, right? And I, 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 I have this group that I joined on Facebook that does like home stuff and interior. And someone just randomly posted that this scent is a must have. Your house will smell like a hotel. Baby. I ordered it yesterday. This is the smallest one. And it's the, the thing is, it's not expensive. I bought the smallest size just to try it. Why is it not focusing? So this is the, a very popular scent. So it says, what brand is this? Air Scent Hotel Fragrance Oils. And this is inspired by the Ritz Carlton. I've opened it while I was on the phone. It smelled fancy. It smelled like a fancy hotel for real. I'm going to wash my diffuser out and put it in there and see but this is the smallest one that they have it honestly smells like like when you walk into like an expensive hotel it does smell i've never been to i've never been to the risk carton but i'm i'm believing that it definitely smells like it it smells really good guys it smells light clean um my camera refuses to focus what is going on hold on my son was saying that some of the size 14s look really big, but that's okay. We'll just switch them out. I did get 12s to 14. I'm not going to do any more shopping until he gets here. We're going to go shopping together. These are all the things that I got from Target. Like a lot of athleisure stuff. I need to take a shower. Uh, I have some dinner. I have to cook the steak. I want to eat it, but I don't want to cook it. I'm going to take a shower and feel better. It's like a set. And then these are just like little soft, sh like workout type shorts, like at leisure shorts that you can wear just casually. 
and stuff because we're building a whole wardrobe, guys. He has no clothes here, okay? So we're doing everything from scratch. These are like athleisure shirts. Again, most of these are from All In Motion. He said these are huge. <laughs> these are training shorts. Yeah, he's like, those look really, really big. I just got a few basic things so he would at least have something until we get to go um, shopping. Jersey knit material. Again, things for casual wear. You know, we have to get some good basics in there. I want to go to H&M because the season is about to change. And especially with going to school, you need uh, stuff for inside. I, why is the school so cold here? I don't know. The insides would be cold. So I have two hoodies, one in the 14 and one in the 12, just to see which one fits better so I can gauge. Once he comes and I, you know, try stuff and I see while he's at school, you know me, I'm always outside buying stuff. So I can just buy stuff on my own time and then these shorts good basics you know I like a neutral palette so you can mix and match and all of that I had other things to show you guys what is that I'm so exhausted like I'm suddenly so tired oh this is another shorts which I thought was such a good basics even though you're not really seeing the details but the quality on it is really nice and the stitching we're not seeing so i will leave all these things upstairs and i will see i want to put them all in the washer to be honest but then i don't know what i need to switch out so those will stay right there i got this fabric liner to go in the bathroom instead of using like a clear one i got this gray one I'm trying to figure out what else I was supposed to show y'all. I'm so tired, guys. These are the things from at home that I didn't get in a bag. They had this Halloween little scrub daddy. So I got that. And this is a stainless steel cleaner. And I thought I would try it. It's for your sink. So I'm thinking it'll work to clean the sink. And poop bags or packs in. A microfiber cloth to clean the refrigerator and guys we have to do a cleaning so probably tomorrow um we can clean downstairs real good hopefully i have the energy but i have to clean downstairs make it nice and fresh and all that and then i bought another candle from at home pumpkin spice you know it's the fall time i'm about to light oh, i have so many new fall candles in the house to light look at look at the jar it is so pretty I don't understand why my camera is being slow. The jar is so, so pretty. So we're gonna light that. And I wish when I, I had seen the pumpkin pillow at, at home that I had gotten it, cause I feel like it would look cute over there. It would. What else did we get? I got these drawer containers to see, drawer organizers to see if I can put them in the nightstand in my son's room. You know, it's a clear, it's like a clear side table that we, I decided to turn into a nightstand. Since it's like black and clear, I'm like, let me add the grays in there. Maybe that will look nice. So we're going to try so that we can somewhat have a way to organize it since it's just clear and there's nothing in it. Um, I think I said um a hundred times, guys. I am tired. That's really what's going on. Oh, I got another thing to show you. <laughs> I had lavender pet wipes at, at home so I bought them for Paxton because I always get wipes for him yay wait my friend sent me something this is her hair oil okay so a friend of mine that I used to work with when I used to live in Jamaica. She has her own hair care oil and she sent it to me. Oh, this is a nice bottle. Island Vibes Organic Jamaican Black Castor Oil. 
100% castor oil. Castor oil aids in healing and repairing the skin. You know I'm gonna be putting this in my hair because we want the hair to grow back. Really nice packaging. It's so cute and it has the Jamaican flag. Come on, girl. I will list her details below and her website so you guys can support. If you want some Jamaican black castor oil, yeah, this is the good stuff. You can, yo, I buy castor oil sometimes. I got the store and it's not the same. This one is real castor oil. Yeah, my hair about to grow. I need to wash my hair right now. I'm keep adding this to my scalp. So check her business out if you're interested in some authentic Jamaican castor oil. Like this thing is strong. Yeah, man. My hair about to grow back right now. <laughs> what else? I think that's all I have to show y'all for right now. They said Christmas. What fall? <laughs> oh my god, I want one of these Christmas trees. Oops. Ugh. I have to come back and get this Christmas tree before it's done. This is the Christmas tree I want in the house, guys. This is the Christmas tree. Oh my god, I'm so excited for Christmas this year. <laughs> I'm too excited for life. I look a mess, but that's okay. I was at the gym. I went to Home Goods. I went to Hobby Lobby. I got quite a few different stuff to show you guys. Matter of fact, I'll just be cleaning. I think there's going to be a clip of me just like cleaning and putting out the full stuff downstairs and completing upstairs. I'm making eggs at four o'clock, but that's not the great news, y'all. My baby is coming on Sunday. <laughs> Ah! I'm going to pick my baby up on Saturday. On Saturday, we're going to Jamaica Ground. We're going to Jamaica, but we're going and we're leaving the same day. Going to get my baby like, come on. It's, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. So anyways, um, I'm making some breakfast, my lunch, but shit, it's like dinner time. Just gonna eat something, get some fuel, get to put in the house together. We're putting a few little fall touches in here. Finish this bathroom up. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Guys, I just got finished having breakfast. There's a lot going on today, girl. There's a lot going on. I'm still in my gym clothes. I feel no shame. I don't feel no shame. I feel so happy right now. You don't even have a clue how happy I am right now. I'm happy, bud. I'm real happy. Anyways, I'm going to be cleaning up those stairs, adding uh, the fall decor that we got from Home Goods. Like the little little things here and there. I almost bought a side table today, and now that I'm kind of looking at everything, I feel like I want to go back to buy it. Um. I might, I might, I might, I might. I think it will, it will add something to the space. I'm gonna mop, add the few things, you know, to add a little depth to the space and the fall decor. I wanted to show you guys the outdoor setup that I'm gonna do. I did show it to you guys yesterday. This is the scatter rug. I just cleaned the door down. I was talking to my dad. So I was cleaning the door down, wiping the glass with like some glass cleaner because my door has like a glass on it. So I was cleaning everything down to remove the old stuff that's out there and then add these. So this is gonna be our scatter rug. And I'm gonna see how I can show you these without messing the whole place up. I'm starting from the front door in. So that's what we're gonna use. This was what I bought at Target yesterday. This was originally what I was gonna use. However, however, I changed my mind. Oh, and this is from Hobby Lobby. I'm so excited. Wait. Got the pumpkin. I can't get it out of the bag. I'm trying to hold the camera, guys, and show you what I got. This is so nice. Yeah. Oh, 
Yes, girl. And that more pumpkin. Where's and then there's a smaller one, but I'm not gonna use this. I changed my mind. This thing, this second rug, hold on, it sheds so bad, like it's shedding a lot. I'm gonna have to sweep. Cause it's gonna shed all over the floor. I'm gonna return the other ones to Target because I changed my mind with what rug I'm gonna use. You're not seeing me. Yeah, ain't no light in here. It's dark outside, it's been raining. So I saw this one and I wanna use this one instead. <sighs> Come in and cozy up. Oh shoot, yo, it shed us so bad. <sighs> I like this one so much better, guys, like so much better. Look at it, oh, I'm gonna show you. And then, look at it. And then that, I need to go for the other one. This looks so good. Oh my gosh. And I got a wreath for the door. That's why we drove to that Target today. I got a wreath for the door. I'm so excited. Just don't, don't clock me on how I look right now, please. I didn't want to do too much. <laughs> I didn't want to do too much. And I saw this. You probably would have seen it in my previous vlog. I don't even know where you're going to see these clips. And so this is nice and dainty and light. I was going to do another one that I saw. But this one is so minimalistic and great. Look, it wiggles together. Now I'm wondering if I, sh if I needed the bigger one. This is very light. I like it. I'm going to put it on the door to see. There's one that I saw at, at home. But that one is like bulky and a lot is going on. What I'm going to do is put this on the door and like fluff her up a little bit. It's up my alley. It's really up my alley. I do very subtle touches. I don't do a lot. We're never into a lot. I'm not going to do anything crazy. It's still going to be modern and just with the vibe of my house. But just like a little bit of like things here and there. Finally, I uh, got the plug out. Let's see something. You can't talk to me anyhow. Oh, shut up. And then the other one. Oh, shut up. Oh my God, girl. I love them. Let me see this. I love the, oh my gosh. And you can plug them into each other. Just so it's like one plug. I'm going to see how I'm going to do it. <laughs> are you kidding me for me please fa -la, 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 la that's what you say fa -la, 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 la i don't know that's for christmas let me stop being silly jesus this looks so good guys look at it 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 ah, 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 ah. oh my god again my door is very big i don't know if the little wreath is gonna be cute there was a big one at at home but it's it, it was just too much I don't, I don't know i do have to go back to at home to return something of course we've just been buying a whole bunch of stuff we've been buying a lot of things and i've just been seeing what works what doesn't work and i've just been putting things back in the car that i might return but i love this i wish it lit up now that the pumpkins are lit up but we're going to try these. And I got a command strip to put it on the wall. Those are from Hobby Lobby. Oh my God, I love them. They're making me so happy. The pumpkins are from Hobby Lobby. The scatter rug is from At Home. The rug itself is from Hobby Lobby. The wreath is from Target. I got this at Hobby Lobby because I was impressed with the color of the frame. I love the greens and the browns. It's giving that nice full vibe that I'm going for. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. I was thinking in the kitchen. Uh, this is actually good quality glass and everything. Unlike the little canvas that I have from Target, I might, I feel like this needs to be, when you come down, it needs to be somewhere where you can see it. It's gonna tie everything together. I just have to figure out the where, the where. That is the question, but it's gonna go. It's beautiful. It has all the warm fall colors. There was a set of frames that I almost bought to put at the front door. Um, 
a Hobby Lobby and now that I'm looking at all the colors coming together I feel like I want to go back to Hobby Lobby far it is very far Same. beautiful it goes with the vibe that I'm going for I was still trying to get the extra wine looking stem from home goods unfortunately it's not there um, I called the home goods location close to me and asked about it today and the lady's just like is this the, 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 what she said, is this the young lady that came and she was, she's like, you were here on Sunday and you asked me for the fall stem. She, oh, somebody's calling me and I'm like, yeah. And she's like, oh, I was looking for it for you, but none didn't come this week. So come back Tuesday. She said, call her Tuesday to see if they get any. Hold on. Hello, hello, hello. No, I'm start ball again, you know. Can we just a ball from here, so? Nothing before the time. Not before the time. All right. God love me. Hey, why are you me full of goose? I'm full of goose bombs and you see that? God love me real bad. I got a phone call. Sorry, guys. So let me show you what else we have really quickly. So we can end this video with the fall stuff. Oh, I got this candle at home goods that's for my son's room not his room sorry his bathroom smell it smells so good it smells like a sexy man it's teak wood and oak it's a scent it's a vibe so that's for him for his bathroom not even, not even for him because he don't really care about stuff like that but you know i'm gonna do it for me i, I want the bathroom to smell good and i got these candles at home good not home goods I'm so used to saying home goods at hobby lobby I wanted some electric candles to put in my candle holder. Just, you know, these are battery operated. I, I thought they looked okay. So we're going to try them to see. Oh, it kind of, it does seem like a real candle, like a candlestick. I don't know if it's going to be like moving, kind of. It didn't say. And it has no buttons. They were cheap. They were like $4. I bought batteries, so let's put the batteries in and let's try them. It looks like it's the flickering ones. Oh, guys. Okay, this is good, but how do you turn it off? How? I'm confused. Twist the base counterclockwise. Oh. Oh. So every time I want to turn it on, I got to go twist it. But that's, that's fine. It's okay. They were $4. Who am I to complain? These, they're fine. I have them from H&M Home. I have them for a while. These are real candles. Every time I light real candles, it melts all over the place like real candlesticks. Not the move. But then, wait. Yeah, this is perf. This is perfect. I'm going to add the other one. You see that? I might have to switch it around. Oh, oh, that looks like a real candle, guys. Like it do, it do. It's kind of a little bit orangey in person, but on this, it looks better. That candle that I got from um, Home Goods, this is the truth. It's on a timer, so it's gonna come on soon. It looks so realistic, really realistic. This one is a little bit orange. I wish it wasn't so orange. I didn't know it was gonna be orange. It looks good on the camera, like the right shade. But it looks very orange right now. Maybe. I know I'm all over the place. It's not giving an aesthetic right now. It's giving real life. This is so pretty. Compared to that one, the, the one from... It's so orange. Like, this one looks more real. Look at it. This one, you can't really see the true shade. But this one, the light is more realistic. That one is so orange. On the camera, it looks perfect. But, like, in real life... This is the one that looks the most like it's really really orange it's bothering me but you know what it was four dollars later on it will look less orange i'm gonna put the other one over there and see 
it probably <laughs> it probably will look better later i don't know what else did i buy i think i bought something else that i need to show to, to you guys oh guys the bathroom the mat why i came home shit the box is still so it was so soaked the amazon guy left it like not towards the door but closer to the end of the porch so all the water was on it it's a stone bath mat it's for my son uh for his bathroom where you step on it and you know it gets dry easily i'm trying to find a scissor i'm gonna open it because i was waiting to open it because i wanted to show it to you guys and i'm gonna see if it's any good yo the orangeness of that is stressing me out like it should be this color <sighs> But I mean, Kimberly, it was $4. Come on. It's something. It's a light. It's bothering me. I might have to buy new candles, but it's okay. Now I know why they were so inexpensive. But it's fine. For now, it could, it could give us the vibe, the flameless vibe. When it gets dark, it will look nicer. Four in the evening. I'm highly caffeinated. And I'm excited. And I'm happy. I'm overjoyed, y'all. Bear with me. Bear with me, baby. Because, yeah... I don't even know how this vlog is going to go together, but it's going to go together. It's happening in real time. It's not real life. This was supposed to be like me doing false, like, you know, putting whatever I'm putting up for fall and whatever new things I bought. But it's a mixture. It's a mixture. Be sure that you're liking, you're commenting. I need my coins. I need my coins. Okay. I'm about to be mommy on a full time. And my kid is expensive. Why that boy said when he get here, you know, once we're settled, if we can go to Dubai. I said, okay, son. So y'all like the video, y'all comment, subscribe. Make sure you're watching and share it with a friend. Please, thank you. Anyways, this looks good. Oh my gosh. Now I want to buy one for my bathroom. I just wanted to see what it was in person. And for the price too. I didn't want to buy two, to be honest. I just wanted to make sure it was worth it. I'm about to buy me one. Because he be getting all the good stuff, you know? Oh wow, it actually is stone. Oh my god. This is nice. It literally is stone. So you get out and you step on there. That's crazy. I don't know why I thought that a stone bath mat would be something that's soft. It's not. Let me see. Can you see me? So you put it there. So that means it won't be smelly. Oh, and then you just get out and you stand. Oh my God, guys, let me show you. I've seen them before, but I never, you know, I never knew what it was. You still can't see my legs. Damn. Okay, this way. So when you get out, boom. It's firm too. And then it's supposed to be easy dry. So there's that. Trying to see what else I bought today, just so you guys can see and I can get, get on with getting my life together. Oh guys, I wanted some new towels for the kitchen. So this one is like more reddish. It really is reddish. It's just is this burgundy. Like it's, it matches my nails. Oh my God. And I wanted to go do my nails. I can't because tomorrow's Friday. I'm going to get my son on Saturday. Hopefully these stay. We'll, we'll deal with the nails after the fact. That's not important, baby. Um, so this is from Heart and Hand. And I like the color. So I'm gonna try them out in the kitchen. And I think once I put the fall stems over there, it will all just kind of come together. It will all grab onto the next thing and it will make sense. That's what we got. I got this cancer holder. I always wanted to get this. And the Target that I went to had it. So we got it. We got it. I just need to figure out what candle I'm going to put in it. But of course, I'm not putting this upstairs. This is not for my son's bathroom. Uh-uh. This is to <laughs> use downstairs in my decor. Love this. And... I bought a new shower liner. I got one yesterday, but it was not a liner. And it was saying, even though it's saying uh, fabric shower curtain, that you need to have a, a, a liner. So that's going to go back. So I just got this frosted 
looking one to go. I think that's all we got. Now I'm going to bring everything upstairs that needs to be upstairs and get everything down here together. So for the rest of this, I'm not going to be talking to y'all. I'm going to just be doing the stuff and then y'all will see what I do. And everything that I have in my house that's at Target, like the new stuff, I'll list them. The box that I have in the garage is from last year, so I thought those things are there. But I added a throw. Um, a few of the new things that they have is in the house, so you will you will see them. Be right back. A little bit more realistic. Found some uh, candles. Oh my god, guys! I went to take the trash can up and I hit my finger. Remember, I was trying to keep these nails. Please don't fail me right now, okay? Because we can't get a nail appointment. Anyways, I found some candles on Amazon, which is on Prime, and they look like dripping candles. And the flame looks realistic. It looks more like this because the ones over there is stressing me out they're gonna have to go i don't like them i don't like them i don't like them i don't like them i want it to flicker they're so orange like i'm looking at it and it's so orange like what candle looks like that look at this one i kind of like how they look with the color of the flame that is that looks real it's six packs. Why did it only come in six? I don't need six. That's a lot. I only need two. But unfortunately, it only comes in six. That's crazy. I don't want six. I just want two. Oh, they have two. Wait. But here's the kicker. They have two for 16 and six for 19. That don't that don't that don't sound like a deal to me. Why do you have six for 19? and two for 16. Mind you, it's $16.99 and then $19.89. That don't sound like a deal, right? That sounds like I should get six, even though I don't know where I'm gonna put it. I don't have any, I don't need it, but maybe that will make me buy more candlesticks that I can just drop around the house. Cause why are we getting two when it makes more sense to pay for six? I'm gonna order them. They look good. Look at this person's video. They look nice. Those look like candles. Let me tell you how, as soon as I finished doing my porch, the rain started. The doors open, so you probably can still hear the rain. I literally wiped the doors down, cleaned the glass, was sweeping the porch off and everything, took the, the old mat that was there up and switched everything out. As soon as I finished, plug the lights in it started to rain it's so cute out there i'm probably gonna give you like a little snippet nothing too crazy because you know how people are creeps but don't come to my house you won't like it the police will come okay the police will be alerted so don't come to my house because uh, you know you got the stalkers and the crazy people but it looks so cute guys like it looks really really cute you hear that it's raining i want to find sure you get a snippet of the front and guys the wreath even though it's saying it's it small Baby, it's beautiful. It's exactly my vibe. This is my jizz. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love it. just went to the garage to get my little fall stuff from last year. It's not a lot. It's a small, you know, U-Haul box. But it'll be just the perfect amount of little fall feels in my home, you know, to give you the vibe. It's gonna be so excited, guys. Like, I love the front door. I love the simplicity of the wreath. I, I know like a big one would have been like so fall or whatever, but I'm not that kind of, you know, that's not my vibe. For Christmas, we're getting a big ass wreath. Sorry, God. We're getting a really, <laughs> a really big wreath, like for real. But I feel like that's enough. It's so me. And guys, tell me why I put the um the hook on the door, and I, I kid you not, that hook is lean. It, I, I try to put it in the center, and it's like off center a little bit. 
it's kind of driving me a little bit nuts but i have ocd but it's okay it's okay nobody else would notice only me oh instantly fall leaves oh wow these are good and perfect these will go back into that black vase that i have i had that from last fall and they still have that black vase in store so these leaves i don't know if they have this right now they have different leaves this year but this is the color that i like perfect and then jesus okay it didn't break <laughs> like this pumpkin and then i have the candles oh my god this is gonna be good i might put this on the table or maybe i take the clear pumpkin from over there and putting on the dining table and then put these over there to add the color i don't know but we have candles to go in these so that's gonna be nice i have two right i think we had two last year i don't remember what we did but it wasn't a lot of fall in the house but it made a difference y'all remember okay it's two okay this is good this is good this is good So I be keeping it neutral. I be keeping it a certain palette. You can use it again and again. And then this was on the coffee table, but I don't know how I feel about her this year. I'm wondering if I can like drop it into another vase that I have, because I don't know if I like this. <laughs> Last year I wasn't sure I liked it, and now I don't know, but it works. And I'm going to put some clips of what the apartment, last year was in the apartment of what it looked like. Last year was the first year I actually decorated for fall a little bit. And it was cute. It gave a cozy vibe, the feel. This was on the coffee table. So I'll figure out if we're going to do the same thing. You know, we're trying to switch it up a little bit. Bits of fall here and there. And what is this? I don't know. Oh, these are bulbs. Why do I have this many? Why did I buy these? Oh, it's a whole box of bulbs. I don't know why I bought these, but we have a whole box of bulbs that I, I don't need. And that's all the fall decor I have from last year, guys. That's literally, that's it. And I have this little pumpkin. Just a little slight stuff, and it made all the difference in the world. Um, so let's get it. I need to go make my thing to mop, and then figure out what we're gonna do. Like, for real, guys? Like, for real? It's really happening. It's really happening. Guys, I'm literally freestyling right now because I fixed that shelf unit over there. The other day, we just found, like, a design that I like. And then now, I want to switch it up because I want it to kind of flow with everything. So I'm wanting to change something. I don't know what. But we're going to figure it out. I'm literally just moving all the decor stuff that i have to one area so i can see and then i'm just figuring out where to put everything i am gonna clean i'm gonna mop do the counters and stuff like that but i just have to try and figure out how this is all gonna go we know the stems are gonna go in this vase remember how i had this vase like right here so maybe I should keep that vibe, add the stems in there, and keep it over there. That looks good. All of a sudden, it's starting to look interesting right there. I have the camera for the inside of my house plugged in over there, but I'm going to have to figure somewhere else to put it right now. But the stems in that corner is looking awesome, I think. So we're going to keep the vase, add the stems so it fills that area. Booking tickets. I'm going to get him on Saturday. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Like, this is too. This is crazy. Okay. Let me finish booking these tickets, but two more nights and he's going to be here. Wow. outside all day well not all day guys i am tired to another level i went to sleep last night at three o'clock i never came back because i was still working in the house and i have to get a few other finishes like little things for the house for my fall decor but i have to put that on pause I, moved, I did like a whole bunch of stuff last night. Like I switched everything from where they were and now I have to find new things because now I have an empty space right here. It's just like a lot going on. But the house is coming together. The fall thing is coming together. I don't even know if I should show you what I did as a little mini reveal or whatever. The kitchen is the best part so far. The kitchen looks really good to me. It's my vibe, like little hints and touches hair in there but it's still clean it still feels light um just got some new stems i went to target went to hobby lobby went to party city now let's open this together i look a mess i just want to know sick well, i look crazy okay i didn't even go to the gym today i didn't have the time nor the energy because i went to bed after three bro so when I woke up, it was like seven. I slept for three, three, probably three to four hours. I don't even feel like four hours. And then since then, I've just been on go. I put some stuff up in the bathroom. Why they came tumbling down? The little things that I bought from Amazon. I have the Q-tips and the um, what you gonna call it? And the the floss. It came with its own like sticky tape. <laughs> I was downstairs and I heard everything like boom, boom, boom. Both fell off at the same time. I honestly thought it was the picture frame that I put in the bathroom, but the command strips, they don't be failing me. Ugh. All right, let me stop because I'm not about to get emotional. While the lady was making the balloons, I was so teary eyed because I'm like, this is really happening right now. Like be for real, this is happening. And even though I feel tired, I feel exhausted, it is worth it. I have so much like anxious feelings, like a lot going on right now. It is worth it. Like, are you kidding me? Oh my God. Okay. I think I'm going to put it here because we're gonna come in through the garage. Paxton, I'm gonna have to move your thing from right there because it's, it's messing with the vibe. I'm not crying, you are. Oh my gosh. Oh. So good. Um, I want to put it like more this way so as soon as you come in, it's there. Because Paxton's thing is upsetting me and my homegirls. It's not giving. This is the spot, and so as soon as you open the door, because ah! <laughs> of course, you know, my main entrance door is my garage because that's where you get out of the car. Let's practice. Let me see. You know, I'll stay fiddling with this until I like it, but of course, we're gonna ignore those. Like, one, two, three. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me stop being crazy. 
I love it, guys. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. This is perfect. <sighs> got the candles i said i'm gonna go take a nap why am i still doing this but these are so good they look way better than the ones from yesterday guys the candles don't mind me i just my my way go. the candles are like night and day this is the one from Hobby Lobby. <laughs> she's like super orange oh i took the batteries out of this one already look at that it's like super orange and then this is the new one look at how realistic this one looks the shape and I have, and I already put one on. It looks so much better. Come, let me show you. And then the other remote, you can do different things to the candle, which I didn't know. How much again, CIS? Even though I need to be taking a nap, because we have a very long day tomorrow. Um, so it has a timer. You can set it for however long you want. Um, you can use it as a light or as a candle. Right now, I'm using it as a candle. Can you hear me? So it's flickering. It's so good. This looks so much better, right? Y'all saw saw how this one looked yesterday. And then it with this, fun. there's no remote. But these have remote. Okay? Look at the difference. I don't know. It's so good. Rip. They look so I much better than See? the one from yesterday. It's a couple of, it's a couple of hours later. I'm trying to get a little bit of like sleep. I didn't sleep. So I'm watching NCIS, as per usual. Yeah. Sure this was a murder when the guy jumped out of the bus. I'm You think he poisoned himself? I don't think so. Means that Kurt Schell. Yes, he did have some issues, but he was on medication. So I'm gonna put like the fragrances on there. I'm about to drop packs it off in like an hour. Got it. He's going to Princess. Yeah, and we have a very early Jump day point. tomorrow. But these are the What's shows. Got point. I just thought it would be a good yeah, idea go. to uh, for now or so uh, they're here and you could add his fragrances or whatever. Tomorrow's the day. Tomorrow's the day. Oh my gosh, I'm going to get my baby tomorrow. My flight is at 10 in the morning. Like, wow, 12 hours from now. Well, a little under 10 hours. I'm gonna try and get some sleep because I have to get up and do my hair. Like, y'all, oh my god, look at this bouquet. Like, this is that's what it's called this balloon bouquet that I went and got for him. Oh my goodness, and it's right in the center. Like as soon as you come through the garage, it's so nice. This is really happening. This is really happening. Thank you, God. And I have a gift for him. I put it on his bed. I'm gonna show it to y'all. I'm charging my stuff up. I, this is an empty suitcase. It's a carry-on. Um, he has his game. Well, I think it's a steering wheel for his game and it needs a whole bag for itself so i'm carrying this for him i'm thinking about bringing my backpack i don't even know but i have my purse um that's pretty much it i'm not taking anything going in the morning coming back in the evening i'm driving to the airport in the morning parking my car and then um charging my headset uh, yeah that's it <laughs> like what else do i need i got my passport and that's it <laughs> This is really happening. God is the greatest. Like, God is the greatest. Like, are you kidding me right now?